In today's YouTube video, guys, I'm going to be showing you the easiest MTZ 556 build that you need to be using right now here in Modern Warfare 3. Now, I'm telling you, if you're trying to increase your KD, any 100 kill games, any MGB nukes, this is the build you need to use. And you're going to see in today's video, I drop over 300 kills and I got you a couple MGB nukes you guys will enjoy. So, if you guys are new, enjoy today's video. Make sure that like button, subscribe to the channel with notice on, and let's get into it. Now, jumping into the new number one MTZ 556 build that is super easy to use. I mean, easy 100 kill games, easy MGB nukes easy way to increase your KD this is the build that you guys need to use but starting off my build we are going to start with the stock here very important that we add on the MTZ Marauder stock this attachment it helps with a lot of recoil control and also a lot of gun kick control now the weapon does have good recoil control but with the weapon having a fast fire rate the weapon does have a lot of gun kick so we're going to calm that gun kick down make the weapon more accurate when firing the weapon and also we are getting a little bit more extra recoil control making this weapon very easy to use up close medium far range any gunfight is going to be more accurate the weapon is easy to control so we're going to throw this on for my first attachment now, dropping down to the magazine, a very important attachment for this build. We're going to add on the 50 round drum. Now, I just want to be aggressive. I want to get high kill games. I don't want to have to slow down, reload all the time, which with my last few builds, I've been using the 30 round mag, the base mag size, but we're going to add on the 50 round drum. We never have to reload with the MTZ, just having a good fast fire rate, a good time to kill. You never have to reload if you're hitting your shots and everything accurately, what you're going to do with this build. You never have to reload. You never have to slow down, reload all the time, get hit in that Kai time. Timing, reload in the middle of a gunfight. The 50 round drum is going to be a must have attachment for this weapon. So we're going to add it on for our second one. Now, jumping up here to the underbarrel next, we're going to add on the brand new paracord grip. Now, this can help with horizontal recoil control, sprint to fire speed, aiming auto sway, and aim walking steadiness. And we also do receive a little bit of mobility, as you guys see here. 7% increase in our aim walking movement speed and a 4% increase in our movement speed. So, we are being a little bit more aggressive, moving fast around the map, getting into more engagements, getting easier high kill games, making the weapon easier control horizontally, and also calming that gun kick down just a little bit, only 2%. Nothing too crazy there, but also we are getting some sprint to fire speed by 12% so we can shoot faster off a sprint, win our gun fights, get all of our streaks and everything. This is a really good attachment. If you don't have this unlocked, hurry up, unlock this thing, daily challenges, complete games. That's the only way to unlock it. So we're going to add this on for our third attachment. Now for the muzzle guys, we're going to add on the brand new attachment as well, the Quartermaster Suppressor. Now that's going to get us off the radar, we're staying stealthy, we're being quiet, going on higher kill streaks, getting our KD up, getting MGB nukes and everything, and also we are getting better recoil control and also making the gun kick a lot more calm, so you should have no excuses on why you miss your shots. This weapon is going to be very easy to control, any range, up close, medium, far range, any gun fight, this became a lot easier to use, so we're going to add this on for our fourth attachment, and then getting into our final attachment attachment here we are going to the barrel and the only barrel that you should be running on the mtz 556 is the clinch pro barrel we're getting bull velocity damage range aiming auto sway and firing aiming stability i will bring up the stats on this we are getting a 26 percent increase in our bull velocity a 21 percent increase in our effective and minimum damage range so our bulls are traveling further they're traveling faster hitting harder giving us a faster time to kill making this weapon very broken now, if we jump into the firing range with our new number one MTZ 556 build here in season five, I want to show you guys the aim down sight speed on this weapon with the large mag, with the weapon itself, and even the large barrel. We are going to have a fast aim down sight speed. The recoil control, very easy. The time to kill, just everything about this build, no matter where you are on the map, you see someone, you aim down sights very quick, and you take them out. You're going to fall in love with this class setup, but also you're going to love the rest of the loadout. As you guys see here, we do have the gunner vest on. It's going to allow us to have an extra primary in our secondary which i went ahead with the super 46 and made a baby smg loadout for you guys to try out very fun to use just in case you do have to reload the primary weapon you pull out the super 46 and you can cause some problems as well but we do have the stun nade on we have the simtex as always Portable radar is my field upgrade, scavenger gloves, running sneakers, and the compression plate. Go ahead, copy the build down, and let me know in the comments what was your best game. But guys, thanks so much for watching. You guys stay safe, and let's get into today's video. There we go. First kill. Hold on. Second kill. All right, so the new number one MTZ build. All right, guys? 5.56, five, not 762. Now... This is definitely a weapon a lot of people are starting to use in Warzone. So, I wanted to try it out here in pubs, and 
I do just have to say, we are actually frying. Oh, and I'm also using a blueprint that the longer I hold down the trigger, it's like reactive, I guess. It, it, it's been in the game for a, like a long time. Let me get that advanced UAV. Let me, let me feel a little bit more comfortable here. There we go. Nah, but uh, I, I quickly do want to mention, I don't like to say it a lot of the times, because I, I just, I, I, I don't, I'm not that type of person, but I am a, uh, a partner with G Fuel, Aim Controllers, Control Freaks, and so if you are looking for any uh, new gear, like if you're looking for some G Fuel before the Black Ops 6 beta, or, you know, uh, a controller, or I mean anything along those three things, uh, use my code PARADOX, you do get a huge percentage off. If you're trying to buy anything like that so and also eventually the long the more p codes that people use my code the more people that use my code i actually would you know eventually get like my own g fuel flavor and my own like controller design and everything like that if that is something that you would want but um let's continue here enough of that yapping we're on a mission trying to get a nice little under kill game and we have them exactly where we want them to be Jesus Christ 40 kills already but we do really need to play some more objective we have a teammate gassing me right now we love that He's saying I'm taking all of his kills. I'm uh, trying us to win the. He's I'm tr that many trying to win the game for us, there, bud. I I know you can shoot through that wall, so I was kind of tracking him. A little bit of the snaps. Uh Bench UAV. Oh my God, they're all underneath me. There we go. Nice little wall bang. Told y'all y'all could shoot through it. I'm going to try getting this guy real quick. Hello, sir. Oh, he's using the cataclysm. We definitely have to be careful with that because that, that is a one-shot kill. Doesn't matter where you are on the map. That is a guarantee. No matter what, one-shot kill. And y'all saw that just the other day. There we go. Okay, we're two more kills off until we get a MGB. There we go. I, I I will say this. I still miss the DNA bomb. I really do. But, um, honestly. Oh, my God. Kids cussing. This ain't good. We're bringing the anger out of kids. I See... I am I am still the same way how was I was a kid. I was I was 11, 12 years old. I was dropping nukes on people, dropping swarm. I, I don't think I was 11 in BO2. I don't know what game it was, but all right, there we go. Nice little 40 gun streak. 41. We only need 19 more kills until we can get a uh, nice little double nuke here. Hold on, where's this guy at? There he is. Corner camping. He spawned right in front of me. I know he's mad. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and pop this swarm. We are on a mission here. We're trying to get a high kill streak and just get a lot of kills. Alright. Uh, advanced UAV. I almost just called it the MGB in. That would not have been good. And they're spawning all right here. Let's go, man. We are at 100 kills. The Ram 9. I haven't seen that gun in a while. Can't get, I can't get all that. Sheesh. Hey, we just have a crazy spawn trap going. 
I mean, and we finally die. I don't even know what gun streak we was on. Maybe it'll tell us in the top right corner. We were on a 60. Let's go. We actually got our double MGB nuke in a life. Let's go. We actually did it. Got our nice little handy dandy Super 46. Little pocket SMG here. How many kills? We're at 125. I might. Just might be able to get like a uh, triple nuke here or something like that. Maybe. We might. Let me see. Feel like I'm gonna have to slow down on the swarms here for a second. I know these people on the other team hate me with passion. I'm gonna let y'all get them. There we go. I want to. I want to hear these guys' reaction on the other team when I call this nuke in. Okay, he's going up. We still have the time. I'm not going to freak out. I'm not going to freak out. Not going to freak out. All that jumping got you killed, bud. You got to you, you got to know when to jump right. I guess he almost did. And hey, well, you killed me. Just just hold the swarm. We might just be dropping 160 plus kills. There we go. Um, gonna chuck that over. Doesn't matter. Didn't get hit. I'm actually sad I choked that nuke right there. All right, call this in. All right, no one's over there. Let me see. I really want to hit someone with a finishing move. I feel like that would just be funny and trolly, but we're st we still have an objective here. We still have objectives. I need two more kills. All right, there we have it, 160 kills. And we are gonna have to call in our MGB nuke here. But 160 plus kills. We almost got three nukes. And we did go on a 60 gun streak. So uh, definitely a uh, first good game. I didn't even kill that dude. A great first game with the MTZ 556. 167 kills, man. Oh my god. There we go. I couldn't even see that other dude for a second. I was like, "What in the what in the world is going on?" Hold on. Let, let me let me back up. Let me let me let me back up here. And let me let me restart. Let me restart. Now they're spawned behind me. And I okay. All right, but um, I think this map is called Das Gross. I don't know. This map is uh, it, it's different. It. I don't know if it's the coloring or what it is really about this map, but it, uh, I think it's kind of gross. I, I don't, I don't know how many of you guys have played, like, what is it? It's, um, like Doom, like Doom 3. I, I remember playing Doom 3 and, uh, hold on, uh, let, let me, let me just get out of here real quick. But it really kind of gives me the vibe of like Doom 3. All right, uh, um, you couldn't kill me. You should have shot me. You should have shot me. You shouldn't have punched me. Now it's a GG. IMS is about to go crazy. We got the advanced UAV. That hurt. Got him. Got him. Got him. What are you doing? Man, I love the advanced UAV. 
You have to love the advanced UAV. You really do. Maybe I shouldn't have done this. All right, we're fine. We're fine. A little bit of a 4v4 now. I'm probably, you know, my teammates are like, well, I'm not getting kills. So why would I stay in the game? Nah, we're, we're chilling though. Throw grab C. Perfect. We have a teammate also trying to streak up as well. Let me get this advance. Let me, nah, actually, let me get my MGB first. There we go. What are we at? Uh, we're 40 and 1 right now. Perfect. Yeah, like, I mean, that. It, I, I feel like I'm just playing Doom 3. I, I don't I don't know. Boom. Boom. I, I might just try going for a high gun streak. I mean, like, we're already on a 37 gun streak, so, I mean, might as well, right? This thing is so good. Now I can't hear myself because of the swarm being so loud. Yeah, we're frying. It's a GG. It is a GG. Um, I'm going to go ahead. Pop the advanced UAV. Work on some spawn kills. We only need 12 more kills until we get a double nuke in a life. So we're we're doing great. All right, eight more kills. We got to do it. That's the guy that killed me last. You ain't killing me again, I'll tell you that. Okay, that the smiley face dude is he scares me. Yeah, that's that guy scares me. Yep. All right, two more kills. Come on. One more. There it is. Two nukes in a life. Yes, sir. Got a nice little 61 gun streak now. I mean, might as well keep going, right? No? Never mind. 81 kills. I think that dude shot my body also. I guess I deserve it, right? If you're still watching the gameplays, on, on an account, you know, often if it happens to you or anything like that, how often does your body get shot in a game? Very curious. A lot of people like to shoot bodies. I mean, I'm I'm part of that only in rank play. I, I only shoot bodies in rank play. Yeah, these guys definitely hate us, and we're I'm glad people are leaving now instead of earlier because we're about to get a uh, hundred kills. And there we go, hundred kills on the dot. We also got a kill chain. Shout out to the swarm. I mean, there is only three people on the other team, so I am going to try. I will try my best to get a nuke with, well, never mind. Okay, there's four people on the other team now. There we go. They're weak. Those prox mines are so annoying. I will start running them if I need to. Shout out to Quick Fix also. We're at 113 kills. I really don't see us getting much, oh, any more kills really. I mean, there, yeah, there's only, there's only two people on the other team now. These guys don't give up, but I. I, I just think I'm going to go ahead and call the MGB in. I mean, this was actually a very fast gameplay. But, um, I mean, hey, still, we dropped over 100 kills. We went on a 60-plus gun streak. We got two nukes in a life. I mean, you can't really go wrong with a video like this. And especially, this is my first time playing on this new version of DOS Hoss. So, it is pretty cool. But 119 kills. There was only two people on the other team. We destroyed that team. Two nukes, 60 plus gun streak. This MTZ build is amazing. You guys are going to love. I do promise.